So, I've got some super exciting news about the Galaxy S25 Ultra design that you're going to want to hear. We're diving into some sneak peeks of both the front and back, and trust me, this new model is shaping up to be quite a departure from the S24 Ultra. So, let's get into it. First off, one of the biggest changes is that Samsung has decided to say goodbye to those sharp corners. The S25 Ultra is embracing a smoother, more rounded look, which definitely gives it a fresher, more modern vibe. I mean, who doesn't love a phone that feels nice to hold? And speaking of holding, Samsung has also ditched the bulky middle frame that was around the bezel on the S24 Ultra. This means we're getting a much sleeker appearance, with significantly slimmer bezels all around. In fact, rumor has it that the bezels on the S25 Ultra are going to be so slim that they'll rival the iPhone 16 Pro Max. That's right, folks. This phone is shaping up to have some of the thinnest bezels in any flagship device hitting the market in 2025. Now, as we count down to the Galaxy S25 launch in January, there's also some buzz about new phone cases to go along with it. A recent leak from the well-known Tipster Ice Universe has shown off a case that could wrap around the Ultra model, and it looks pretty slick. This aligns perfectly with what we've been hearing from other leaks, showing those rounded sides and corners that make the device look even more appealing. The rear camera layout looks similar to what we've seen on the S24 Ultra, which is cool, but don't let that fool you. Just because the layout might be familiar doesn't mean the cameras aren't getting some serious upgrades. And if you're curious about where everything is on the phone, this case leak shows that all the buttons and ports are right where you'd expect them to be. Volume buttons, power button, USB-C port, and the speaker grill are all in their usual spots. So while the S25 Ultra isn't going to look dramatically different from the S24 Ultra, those rounded corners and the new asymmetrical frame will definitely make it feel a lot nicer in your hand. Now let's talk about how the S24 Plus compares to the S24. You'll notice that the corners are less rounded. Bezels on the S25 Ultra are much smaller. It's amazing how just a few tweaks can make such a big difference. And even though the camera might look a bit smaller in some photos, it's expected to maintain a similar design to the S24 Ultra, but with exciting enhancements that should blow us away. When you stack the S25 Ultra next to the iPhone 16 Pro Max, the Samsung phone really shines with its slimmer bezels. You can see the difference when you look closely, and that sleek design just makes the S25 Ultra look more polished and modern. It's all about that first impression. As for the back design, we've seen some evolution here too. Early leaks hinted at a design reminiscent of the Galaxy Z Fold 6, but the latest images show off a more unique style for the camera lenses. Those lenses appear larger compared to the S24 Ultra, and the layout has been adjusted with smaller gaps between them. It's like Samsung is taking the best of what worked and making it even better. In a nutshell, the S25 Ultra is shaping up to be an impressive device with a fresh design and some killer features. If you're eyeing the Galaxy S24 Ultra, there are some amazing deals happening right now that you won't want to miss out on. So, if you enjoyed this info and want to stay updated, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Your support means a ton. Thanks for hanging out with me today, and I can't wait to catch you next time.